Hey guys, welcome to the Bonus Mom Diaries. I'm Shani Sanders. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. So listen, let's get started. We already been through step number one, which was to define your role. Step number two, we said about building healthy relationships. Step number three, I'm going to tell you to find your niche. And I know you think about a niche and you're like, this is not a business. I'm not building a brand. So what do I need to really find a niche for? Well, let me tell you what it is. You are building a family brand. No matter what, like I keep telling you, no matter what, this woman is a part of your life, your husband is there, your children, you guys are a family brand, you are a family unit. So you wanna find out what you're good at. So what I mean by niche is that you wanna find something that you can offer that can really help everyone in this situation. So let me give you an example. I'm really good at party hosting, party decor. I'm really good at that, you know, and I offer that to my bonus kids moms because I'm like, hey, I can take that weight off your shoulder. And every time I turn around, it's time for a birthday party. We have six kids, so it's always a birthday party. And so I'm able to come in and really help and take that piece off of them and do all the decorations and make sure everything is set up so it's ready to go so everyone can have a good time. And that really relieves a lot. So I try to make things fun and entertaining for the kids just to put, do my part and help. So that's what I'm telling you to do. Find your niche. Your niche may be, hey, I'm really good at helping with schoolwork. I'm really good at, you know, the internet and making sure that kids do those research really well. You might be a person that researches really well and you can offer that when it comes to helping them with homework. You can offer that to say, hey, you know, I really enjoy helping kids with homework. I'm really good at research. I'm really good at math. I can really tutor a child who's maybe struggling in that in that area. I can really help our children and I can help them move forward in their education and we can do it as a partnership. Because I'm telling you, once you're able to offer something, it all relates to building a better relationship with your children's mother because that's really the goal here. To have a truly harmonious relationship with these children, your husband, you have to have one with their mothers. So let's continue to build on that. But know what your niche is, know what you can offer that can really help everyone and relieve something from their mom because it's a lot to be a mom. And they're always, they're always need help. And we're only, we're only here to help and to offer. So offer what you're good at. You're probably good at so many different things, but offer what you think is needed. You analyze the situation and realize, hey, what's needed here? What can I offer that will relieve stress for everybody in this situation? So offer that and see where your relationship goes with their mothers. I'm telling you, you're gonna be so amazed by how it goes. So listen, that's it for me today. Make sure you guys tune in next week for another bonus mom diary. I'll give you another tip on how to create such an amazing community and be such a great bonus mom to your children, but also be a really good girlfriend to their mothers as well. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye.